Hello everyone, uh, myself Ravi Kumar Pargund, a student from PDA College of Engineering, Kalburgi. So today I will going to explain with the ALP that is Assembly Language Program of 8086 Microprocessor. So the program number is J14 that is data transfer using string instruction. So we are transferring some data, the number of data using some string instruction. So basic funda to write the program so we have to understand what is mean by string string is a block or array of data then we have to assume five bytes we are taking in data segment so take for example i will be taking in the program 0 1 0 2 3 4 5 five data bytes i am taking then third one is take in data segment mica is the memory location for the given data and sasural is the memory location for the storing data after transfer so why i have taken mayuka and sasural is to make the program interesting you have to you you want to take uh, if you want to take any any name you you can take then important instruction which will be used while writing the program use cx register compulsory for count and uh, use di pointer compulsory for extra segment then use cld that is clear direction flag so for auto increment of memory pointer so it is most uh, important uh, powerful instruction that will auto increment the memory pointer to move a use to move a string move the string use special instruction rep move sb it means repeat move string byte so where rep is the prefix which is used for repetition note that repeat rep is not an instruction so this is all about funda let us execute program so click on start emulator then type cd space 8086 click on enter then type edit space j14.asm so i already written the program just i will go through the explanation how the program works and what are the string instruction that all so j14 the program number j14 that is data transfer using string instruction data transfer using string instruction so string is a block of data or array then da in data segment data segment org0h so originating the in the data segment the given uh, uh, we have to give the data which we want to transfer that is memory location for given data is mica and db 01020304405 the data so now data ends then we have to transfer the data in extra segment therefore start with the extra segment extra segment org 0 edge then sasural is the memory location for the transfer data after execution so db question mark which because we have to transfer it so then extra ends start with the code segment code segment assume cs as code ds as data and one more thing es as extra that is es colon extra for extra segment keep in mind so main colon then move ax comma data then move ds comma ax move ax comma extra then move es comma ax these are all fixed lines when data along data segment along with the extra segment it comes then move cx comma 0 5 this is main line uh, cx is fixed for string whenever we are writing string programs you we have to use cx so see move cx 0 5 for because of five data bytes we are having then leasi this is the step to initialize the source and destination pointers so first one is the source pointer that is leasi memory location is mica then load effective address di sasural for 
uh, what is the stored information data location after execution so these two are the main important line that is a cldn rep mosb these are main main important instruction uh, because of these two lines the program uh, is most important so cld it makes clear direction flag for auto increment of memory pointers then repeat move sb this is repeat move string byte then we have to move the data one by one it will uh, it will perform that for function that is move string bytes one by one so then after moving all data we have to end the program that is by typing move h comma force h in 21 h then code ends and main this is now let us save the program so let us save click on file and you will get options click on save then afterwards again click on file and you can ex you should exit then afterwards for execution type masm j14 j14 dot asm semicolon click on enter i will be getting zero warning errors and zero severe errors okay then go to next step that is link space j14 dot obj semicolon click on enter then no stack segment then go to debug step debug space j14 dot exe click on enter you will get a slash then type u for unassembling unassembling then after typing u you will get offset addresses like this then search for move h comma 4c a row then row then find the offset address of that row i will be getting g is equal to g is g offset address is 1 8 therefore 0 space 0 space 1 8 click on enter i will get so mem result will be in memory uh, the given data will be in memory and the result will be in extra segment so therefore uh, click d space ds colon 0 click on enter then you can see that clearly 0 1 2 3 4 5 the given data is there so that will be transferred in extra segment we can see that by typing d space ds colon d space es colon 0 click on enter you can clearly see that the data is transferred in extra segment the same data whatever you we have given that will be transferred in the extra segment you can clearly see that so this is all program execution completely thank you